Hello friends, uh, today we're really excited about uh, the topic, uh, what we are just going to discuss. It is about uh, the mind hack of how to take action. So a lot of us, so we know what to do, but we do not take action. So that is what we are going to talk about. Uh, how do we take real action? Okay, even though we know things, uh, sometimes we do not take action. Why is that so? Okay. And that is what we are going to discuss. So let's move on the mind hack. Okay. So now you see um, there are three, three things which uh, you know is put together for us to take action. So this is kind of uh, you know um, all um, linked with each other. So as uh, you can see on the screen or if you're on the podcast, uh, let me just explain you. Uh, it's the belief, action, and result. Okay, so this goes hand in hand. It's all you know combined together. So that means um, I would not take any action if I do not have belief that you know this is going to produce what the result. Okay, so and the belief will not come unless I see the result. Okay, and uh, the result won't come uh, if I do not take any action. So if you see all these three, belief, action, and result, these are all interlinked. So that means how do I take action if I do not know? How do other entrepreneurs, you know, how do they take action? Or, you know, if you are an athlete, you know, you, um, or you want to, uh, you know, shed your weight, okay? So you are, you want to, you know, reduce your weight by a few, few pounds. What do you do, okay? So a lot of time we, that is an inertia. So we don't take any action, even if we know what to do. Okay. So let's jump into it. So how do we break these shackles of, you know, in a internal inertia and you take actions. Okay. So as you now know, the belief, action and result, these are all combined together and belief is something which is mental. Okay. And action is something which uh, you take action. You, you know, it's is uh, physical thing. So what you need to do. And the result is the, uh, you know, the um, sort of, uh, you know, the uh, our byproduct or the end, uh, you know, product of you taking the action. Okay. So what is so important in these, uh, all the three uh, things, the most important thing is the brain. Okay. A lot of time, if I take a lot of action, okay, without having that belief, um, you know, I just have to, okay, I know that, you know, uh, I have to um, uh, have the muscles, okay, or I need to um, sell more to, uh, to create that success. So I need to go and talk to people. So you won't have that passion or you, you feel like, you know, uh, you will not, even if you are taking a lot of action, uh, you know, deep within that, uh, you know, the results won't come. Okay. And the easiest way and how we hack our mind is uh, let me tell you the secret and the secret here is uh, the way the mind is uh, programmed or the mind works okay so the hack here is the your mind does not differentiate does not know what is uh, the real thing which has happened physically outside okay or which has not happened uh, you know outside okay so that means mind uh, you know or our brain it um, it uh, you know receives all the signals uh, you know from different parts of our body and as it perceives things you know it sees it it feels you know so with all the sensory organs okay so the hack here is i have to force myself to believe it how do i do that simple hack the hack is i have to vividly internally i give my brain enough evidence that this has already happened okay so that means i'm deceiving my brain in a way okay and that is something which has been there since ages you know since quite long all the people who are hugely successful they have already conceptualized and visualized uh, before they accomplish those things so we can do the same thing so that means what do you do? So we just have to close your eyes and visualize yourself vividly. Multiple times if you visualize that you have already done it. Okay, done what? So that we have already taken the action and it has produced the result. So these two things, action and result, if you vividly imagine, 
Okay, imagination is uh, what, what happens with the imagination. As uh, you know, um, Einstein says, uh, the greatest nation is imagination, you know? So that's what the power of imagination is. So imagine, so when you imagine what, what do you do? So it's, uh, it's the vision or your visual gets activated. And then second is you try to invoke all other sensory organs and you start to feel Okay, so but you are taking action. You just in the, in your mental eyes, you you uh, see yourself taking the action. Okay, and then you are getting the result. Okay, mental eye multiple times. You do it several uh, times in a day, especially before you go to sleep um, and after you wake up. Okay, immediately when your subconscious mind is active or the alpha brain is uh, you know is active that is the time when we put our inner subconscious mind. what is subconscious mind anyway subconscious mind uh, is what controls our conscious thing you know that means what controls our action okay outside things or a better brain so um, you know, when we program it and how do we program it? Vividly imagining, okay, and feeling that already you have accomplished that. And what happens in this process is, you know, your brain gets enough evidence. This has already happened. This is real. You know, you are getting the result. So what happens then? So you are, you know, just uh, that loop continues. That means so you have enough belief comes up, okay, and then you will take action. So this is the real deal. And this is the way anything and everything can be fixed okay with that we are done until the next episode over and out